to go looking for stuff at the garage sales. If I find anything, I will keep you updated. Whoa. Uh, I just went to that sale over there. Yeah, because he likes to park in right in front of the cars. We okay. can't see But there, there was a sign that said, my, my kitchen was clean last week. Sorry you missed it. Yeah. It's actually saying that it's not clean this week. Anyway, no games. He said he had one. Couldn't find it. But I'll see you guys at the next stop. I finally found some stuff. I got a little Mario bag. This was a dollar. It ended up being, I think, $31 for everything. I got that for a buck. Do you know what that is? What is it? It's a handbag? Oh my god. What? It's a lunch box. Oh, oh, oh that's right, because I think of the back. Okay. Oh my, my bad. God. Lunch box. And then. Um, for for Genesis, I got Eternal Champions. It's missing the manual, but I got that. I got a copy of Wii Sports on the Wii. That's a solid 20. I got Mario Kart. No manual, but I have an empty case in manual somewhere in the car here. Hopefully, if I, if I brought it, so I can make that complete. And then I got a complete copy of Smash Brothers Brawl on the Wii. Uh, he said we missed all the, the, the stuff this morning, but I guess he had this stuff just hiding in his like little garage there. So, good deals. See you guys at the next stop. That way at a church rummage sale. Uh, the only two games they had were for PS2. One was, I think, a football game. One was Tiger Woods. And I don't need those. But uh, they had some computer. They had, they had a few computers and some TV screens. They had G.I. Joe on Blu-ray. I noticed that was kind of cool. But outside of that, it was just, you know, random knickknacks and stuff. But anywho, onward and upward. Ooh. I don't think he found anything, but we stopped right there. Up at that garage sale over there. They had some Buzz Lightyear toys from the new movie Lightyear. But outside of that, uh, no game stuff, some Star Wars stuff. There was a Woody uh, from Toy Story uh, blanket, actually. It, it kind of reminded me of uh, maybe the Bucky one, actually. Anyway, uh, no games there, and maybe we'll go hit up a couple of pawn shops on the way back. The sale there and there. Um, we just missed, I guess somebody came by earlier and grabbed some Switch stuff, which sucks. I really need some Switch stuff for this convention. And then she said that, I guess, her boyfriend or husband got like a 64 somewhere, um, but... They didn't really have any games for it, I don't think. But I guess he wasn't selling it anyway. Anyway, I'll see you guys at the next stop. Woo. Apparently this is a community yard sale, by the way. There's like sales like every few blocks. So, woo. Okay, just stopped at Cash America Pawn. And I found this Monopoly on the Switch. Woo. So yeah, sorry about that. The, during the last clip, I keep getting calls by scammers that, that want to give funding for my business. And the first guy called, and while I was on the phone with him, trying to do the funding business thing, and I was gonna like, you know, troll him a little bit, but then somebody else called me and said the same thing. And they're like, hey, this is Today Capital. How much money do you need for your business? Mm -hmm. And I'm like, uh, no, I only do business with Tomorrow Capital. And he's like, well, we also have Today, Tomorrow, Yesterday, we have all kinds of capital. <laughs> But, anywho, so yeah, like I was saying, I stopped at Cash America Pond and I got Monopoly on the Switch for five bucks. Crazy deal. This one's got to be at least 15. And then there was another Jimmy's Pawn Shop behind them. It said Pawn Shop, but the only thing they had inside were rifles and guns. No video games. They had barely even anything else besides that. So I'm going to do one more clip uh, uh, for the recap and I'm going to wrap this whole, whole thing up. And I will see you guys in a second. The recap clip. Woo! Okay, so here's our finds for the day. We have Wii Sports, Eternal Champions on the Sega Genesis, 
uh, oddball that they just had one Genesis game. Was hoping for more. Obviously, the Monopoly that I just found. We've got Super Smash Brothers Brawl. This one is minty and complete. That's like 20, 25 bucks. Then we've got Mario Kart, which I should have the case and manual for in the car somewhere since we're all packed. Uh, I'm back at the Island Resort Hotel. This will officially conclude this Fort Walton Beach Garage episode. I know it wasn't necessarily the longest one um, in the world, but we found some stuff. We're gonna go. I'm gonna go set up in a couple hours here anyway, because today's Friday. Getting ready for this con. Really rad weekend. Check it out. Uh, Bam's gonna be there but it's gonna be nuts. So I'll see you guys next time we go hunting at garage sales. So I'll see you guys there. Bye, woo. Okay.